You want to stretch information? Here's the easy way to do it. This information's a group. Now I could individually move all of these objects, but it's better if I just select all of them, get my reshape tool, drag the marquee around the corner I want to move, and then move that corner. And you can see it stretches all of those objects. To me, this is a great stretch. It's not like the interactive scaling mode. It does literally stretch the objects. Here's another situation where stretch is so useful. I've got some slab thickening here for a load bearing wall, but it's in the wrong place. So it, I'm just going to use my reshape tool. It doesn't matter which of these options I choose. I'm just going to draw a marquee around the area I need to stretch, grab hold of the middle point, move along here, find the middle of my wall and let go. And now I've just moved that all the way along. If I've got this end out as well, so I can just drag it around there. I can drag that across. It lines up with my foundation. Let go. And there it is. So it's just a really quick way to do that. And now if you make a mistake, you can leave the marquee where it is and just stretch it back until it goes there. But you can also use the move command. So if you go move, you can say I want to move that six inches and it'll just move everything inside that marquee six inches. Move again, minus six inches, and back it goes. So this is a really quick way, and I call it stretch, because literally it is just stretching those polygons around. And you can include lines and all kinds of stuff in there. We used to use this for moving doors and windows, but now that we've got set position, it's no longer needed. Thanks for watching. Hey, don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you like this movie. It really helps other people to find them, and it really does increase my numbers, so please do that. I've got a community where I teach a lot of Vectorworks. So if you want to join my community, click on the link below. It's really good value for money. Thanks for watching.